Welcome to Allie in the Valley. I'm Allison Ball Kilmer. Allie in the Valley is a lifestyle blog about healthy, delicious food, all while staying on a budget. Homegrown cooking, down to earth living. Hey, welcome back to Allie in the Valley. Today I'm going to do one of my all time favorite. Almost everything's my all time favorite. But this is one of my favorite, an easy, easy fish stew. I love stew, and fish stew is healthy. It's very quickly to make, like 30 minutes. And what I do is I just put all yummy fish, cod in there, lobster, shrimp, whatever you like. Um, so I get these little lobster tails that I put in. I put shrimp, I put cod with onions and garlic and parsley and tomatoes, and bam, you got a fish stew. First things first, you know what we're gonna do, we're gonna saute our onions. So let me put a little bit of olive oil. You can use any kind of oil you want. I'm using olive oil. You know, I think avocado oil, to be honest with you, is the least fatty. One onion, chopped. Chop some parsley. You're gonna cook the parsley, onion, and garlic for just about two minutes. Really light, you don't wanna overcook them. You just want to saute. Now, you can use brushed tomatoes or canned tomatoes. I'm in a hurry. This is a summertime quick dinner, uh, weeknight meal. I'm using canned tomatoes with a little garlic, oregano, and basil. I love this brand. So here's our base starting. This is the base of the soup. It already smells delightful. I'm just gonna do a smidgen of um, tomato paste to thicken it up, to thicken your soup up. A couple squeeze. We're gonna cook that for about 10 minutes. We really want it to get thickened and yummy and all the herbs come together. Now I'm gonna add in clam juice. So clam juice I use for gumbo. Anytime I'm doing a seafood soup, or something like that. Some clam juice. Now, I am going to add some wine to it. Just a half a cup of wine for the flavor. You can use any kind of wine you want. I'm gonna use my Pinot Grigio that I normally drink. I can drink this whole bottle. Now, I'm gonna start putting my seafood in. So, these are the little lobster tails. Okay. Um, I'm going to put shrimp in. And really, you can do any kind of seafood that your heart desires. I really like cod because it's flaky, it cooks really quickly, it's healthy. So, this is cod. You can do catfish, you can do whatever you like. This one. And it's okay that the juices of the fish go in because you want that base. You want that fishy juice base. Now I'm gonna do a little seasoning with salt and pepper. And then I'm gonna let this all cook so the fish cooks. Now remember, the fish is not gonna take a long time to cook. And this is gonna kind of boil down and the sauce is gonna get on top of it and the juices and cook it down, just like a stew. All right, so this is gonna take about 10 minutes before the 10, 15 minutes when the fish starts getting flaky and then we'll start adding some more flavor. Okay, so I think my fish stew is ready and that's what I love about this fish stew. It happens fast. Fish doesn't take long to cook. Cod doesn't take long, but come over here and check it out before I put the seasoning on it. More seasoning. Look at this. The fish is flaking apart. See how easy? That means it's ready. So I have shrimp in here, cod in here, and the little lobster tails. Now I'm gonna put some of my little seasoning on the essence I use all the time, just to give it a little bit of a kick because this was one of my quickies. So it didn't get to sit around and just sit in all the seasoning in it. So I wanna give it a little bit more of a kick. I'm gonna put some oregano in it. Kick up the seasoning a little bit more. Seems fine. Fine. And I'm 
gonna do juice of a lime. Just to give it a little bit more of that seafood lime Baja taste. This is about a 30 minute, honestly, a 30 minute seafood stew. You can see how the meat's all chunky. There you go. Oh, I need some hot sauce. I don't know how to put no hot sauce in this, baby. Oh, what was I doing? On oh, camera gets me a little forgetful. All right, hot sauce, depending on how you like it. You could do no hot sauce, but that wouldn't be Alley in the Valley with no hot sauce. <laughs> All right, it's ready. There you go. Fish stew. Nice and thick. It's a little hot. Let me get a spoon to taste. The flavor's all there. And look at this, see how the fish breaks apart? That's how it has to go. The fish breaks apart, that means it's ready. That's what I love about cod. Cod is really easy to cook. And it holds a lot of flavor. Mm. That's really good. Healthy, yummy fish stew. You know where to get the recipe? www.allyinthevalleyfishstew.com